this summer, we're highlighting the many ways Minnesotans are getting back together. In Rochester, Thursday's downtown is back, and Susan Elizabeth Littlefield is checking out the weekly celebration and joins us live. Susan Elizabeth, it's so nice to see everyone getting back together. Oh, I couldn't agree more, Jeff. It is so much fun out here. Now, you know, of course, Rochester is an internationally known city because of the state of the art medical facility they have here. And you know, it's been a really heavy year. So I'm going to step out of the way so you can see that the mood has lightened up a lot around here. They certainly deserve it, and they could not be happier to be getting back together. Thursday's downtown. It's a 10 year Rochester tradition, but this year is different. Different for the 20,000 plus patrons. It's completely amazing to see people out here. Um, no one's wearing a mask. Different for the 80 vendors. I mean, right now, the, the kickoff and the, the amount of people that are here that are nearby each other is great. It's fun. And it's different for the thousands of healthcare heroes who work just feet away. We were just saying how exciting and good this feels to be back into somewhat of a normal, normal state out here. Because for the staff of the Mayo Clinic, the past year has been anything but normal, especially for those on the COVID unit like Michelle. It was, uh, you know, scary at that time. And to come and see everybody back together, this is what we worked for. This is what we wanted to do. And it feels good to see how resilient we are. So. And resilient they are, enjoying an old favorite of a festival with a new sense of gratefulness. This is that one step back towards normal. So after a year of keeping their distance, these Minnesotans are coming in close, and the more, the merrier. So yeah, if you have nothing to do, come to Rochester because we will take care of you. Come on, come on, come on down to Rochester. Now, something else really powerful that I saw out here today was a good amount of patients who came out in their wheelchairs. They left the Mayo Clinic. They came out here, listened to some music, had some fun, ate some food, and this fun is going to continue. In fact, there's a stage behind me, and a major recording artist is going to be out here performing a concert tonight at 7 o'clock. I'm going to talk more about that at 6. Back to you in the studio, Jeff. Positive vibes all around, okay? Thank you, Susan Elizabeth.